Hey everyone, it's Kevin in Texas coming at you on this very damp and cold March day. Word on the street is that Russian Federation President Vladimir Putin has offered Ukraine a complete and total cessation of hostilities if the Ukraine government agrees to three principles. Number one, neutrality, in that Ukraine will no longer be eligible to join any military alliance they will be an outright neutral country. The second condition is the recognition of the Donetsk and Luhansk republics. And the third listed condition is recognition that Crimea is now and will forever be part of the Russian Federation. Some free advice for the Ukrainian president and legislature. Take the deal. Take the deal. Because right now you're on the verge of losing your entire country. Your capital, Kiev, is surrounded by Russian forces. And if things continue the way they have been going recently, you will not have a country left to fight for soon enough. So I'd advise you to take the deal, end the war, spare any further loss of life and loss of infrastructure, and then rebuild. And rebuild in a different way than you were before. I would recommend looking at Switzerland and modeling your new government after the Swiss government. And this includes how your citizens or residents are educated and trained. And I realize that a lot of the people propping up your regime currently are more than willing to fight to the last Ukrainian. But as a leader of a country, you have to look out for the well-being of your people. Sometimes that means taking a loss right now to prevent further loss in the future. More importantly, though, that means setting up a scenario where your people survive. And the best way to do that right now is to accept the deal offered by the Russian Federation. And then you can begin strategizing on how to build your country for the 21st century. This is Kevin in Texas taking a realist position and saying God bless each and every one of you. I'll talk to you later. Bye.